Let's sing a song full of hope, full of pain Why don't you sing along, my friend, for it's our last refrain Forever young, ever strong, ever brave Memories like this never end, no, they don't fade away So when I'm morning and welcome back to another vlog i'm literally i've literally only just started my makeup so i do look a bit weird I look a bit like one dimensional <laughs> i'm just doing my makeup this morning i've only got one lecture today um it's monday i hope you have a wonderful week ahead for some reason recently i've been really enjoying mondays um they're like my favorite day of the week which is kind of weird i think it's because i only have one lecture and i just like the whole starting a new week fresh and like planning out my week um and just sort of like getting everything prepared. Like I just quite like Mondays at the minute, which is quite different. Yeah, I'm just doing my makeup just to get ready for the day. I'm feeling like recently when I'm making more of an effort with my face and like my outfit and stuff, I feel like a lot more prepped for the day rather than just like lazing around and just not feeling good in myself. So yeah, I've been like making a little bit more effort recently. I'm watching Emily Rose's new vlog. She started vlogging a lot more, which I'm thoroughly enjoying. And um, she's also another uni vlogger. You probably know her already um but if you don't i will leave her channel down below because i've been really enjoying her vlogs yeah oh god i can stop breathing then uh <laughs> you're laughing at, you're listening to me yeah i've been really enjoying using hula um the hula bronze by benefit again hattie um doesn't use this anymore so she gave me and i was like yes it's like like my favorite warm toned warm toned bronzer it's really lovely in winter I like to give yourself a little bit of a healthy glow i also need to find like a new foundation um that's good for dry skin that's like full coverage i really want to get the fenty foundation that megan has um but it's just spent expensive i don't know if i can justify it just at the minute you know like I'm not very financially stable at this point in my life so maybe that's a christmas present idea <laughs> So I've just made me and Aiden a cup of coffee from with the coffee machine downstairs and I used the gourmet drops from the Degust recent Degusta box that I got and apparently they taste really good like Hat's been raving about them. I haven't actually tried them yet um, but Aiden just said it really tastes good so I'm going to give it a little taste. Oh, that is good, isn't it? Wow. I've, I'm gonna have to buy them when they run out, you know. What, what are they? What they're called. I don't know. They're just literally called gourmet vanilla drops, but obviously they have a brand on, but I can't remember it. So good. I can imagine it's gonna last a while. I can't pronounce that. Tessieri. Tessieri. You've got me So I just cut my finger. Um, just gonna make some quick pitter and hummus before heading to my lecture. I've only got one hour in um, and we're doing perimortem trauma. So like trauma during like during death, which is interesting. Should we have some grapes now as well, Aid? Should we have some grapes as well? We'll have some grapes too. Pizza and hummus sitting in a tree. K-I-S-S-I-N-G. Have some grapes. Then comes marriage. I've got literally like 15 minutes. Um, right, so Aiden's just um, met me after my lecture and we're going to the mailbox. So I'm gonna chill in there for a little bit. Uh, maybe play a game as well, board games as well. Oh, They've got really fun board games. Um, and yeah, we're just gonna grab some food, I think, and have a drink. Inter interactive quiz games on the machine um because i'm addicted and i'm too competitive so yeah into the mail so we're just in the mailbox um and we've both got wings we've got some fries delicious um i had points on my mailbox card so this is pretty much free which is paying and we just got a glass of cider each as well crazy 
crazy day, drink, day drinkers, aren't we? Wild. Thought I would treat myself looking around the Primark homeware, and it's actually so cute. Like, um, Aiden's just gone to find a costume for one of his society things, and like, look how cute some of these colours are. It's like very autumnal at the minute. Um, thoroughly enjoying this like plum colour. So cute. I'm also really enjoying all of these like Christmassy cushions and like blankets. It's making me really excited for December. So cute. <laughs> Right, so I haven't vlogged in absolutely ages because I've just been chilling with Aiden. It was his last day um, here. He just left about half an hour ago. Um, I'm just sort of organising my life. I just watched Alice's video. She just hit 50,000 subscribers, which is crazy. It's just amazing. So well done, Alice. But yeah, I haven't really done much since I got back. I've just been doing a bit of work um, for my blog and stuff. I've almost finished my barley, one of my barley posts that I've been wanting to do for a while. It's just taken me a long time because there's quite a lot of content and stuff and I've just been organising everything for the rest of the week because I've got a busy week ahead but it's so fun. I'm heading to London with Carrie. Wednesday we've got a couple of events and we're staying all day Thursday as well to get some content done. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know, I'm just feeling really like happy and grateful again which is amazing. Like I had a really bad um, rough time a couple of weeks ago and I thought I wasn't going to get out of it and just moments like this where I just appreciate get to spend time with all the amazing people in my life I like remember how amazing my life is yeah my spirits are back up again which is amazing and I'm so happy about that so thank you for everyone supporting me I can't remember if there's anything I was meant to tell you um but tomorrow I'm actually getting my lashes done um by this wonderful lady that my hairdresser recommends and I know a lot of you have actually gone to Rosie Roslo's hair on Instagram who does my hair. I know a lot of you guys have actually gone to her after watching my Megan and Hats transformation in February and then I've also had my hair redone in August and styled since. And everyone seems to love Rosie. Like she tells me a lot of you guys go in and have got that your hair done by her which is amazing because she is the loveliest person and it's nice that she's getting so much business because I just love her and I just think she's amazing and she needs more credit so if you're ever looking for a hairdresser in Lincoln check out Roslo's hair on Instagram but she recommended I basically was asking if she knew of anyone around the Lincoln area that's really good at eyelash ex like extensions because after I had them done for Bali for the first time I've just been like craving getting them done again because it makes me feel so like put together like I don't even feel like the need to wear makeup at all and um, when I've got my lashes done I only like pop on a bit of eyebrow product because my brows are like really sparse and thin um yeah I just I just feel so much more confident so I've been scoping the area and then I asked Rosie last time I had my hair done and she was like oh my god you have to check out check out this person that I'm going to tomorrow and has fi we finally found a date that suits us because she's super busy like she's very well loved and she's like the only lash technician Rosie says she trusts so I'm really counting on this I'm really excited I'm actually going to her house um to get them done tomorrow and hopefully she'll let me film and if not then I'll obviously show you the before and after because I'm so ready to get the hybrids that Rosie gets honestly um there's like loads of different lashes that she does but Rosie gets the hybrid lashes and they look so good on her eyes like, so I'm really excited. I'm really, really excited. I'm going to head there tomorrow. I'm going to walk, I think. It is like a 35-minute walk, um, which will be nice. It will be nice and refreshing in the morning. So um, me and Meg are going to go watch Towie. Meg's come back home um, from home, <laughs> if that makes sense. And we're going to watch Towie because we haven't haven't watched Sunday's Sunday night's episode. So, yeah. So I've opted for this for Wednesday's Halloween party. Carrie just sent over the information because it's actually an event that she got invited to and invited me along with her on Wednesday. Um, it's quite cute because we've both got like an event each on Wednesday and we're inviting each other in London. But um, this is like a mask Halloween party. So I was like, oh, this is cute. So we've gone for this like gold lacy mask from Miss Guide and it's actually half price. So I'm really happy. Um, and I got it on our next day delivery. So pretty that's what we're gonna be wearing on Wednesday <laughs> right so I am just about to go to bed and um, before uh, I end the vlog I thought I would just give you guys a little bit of hope um, if anyone's new or just doesn't really know the logistics of my relationship um, I've been with my boyfriend since we were like 14 years old since 2013 
and we've been together for six and a half years now almost and we're at completely different universities we were at school together but Aidan's now studying in London I'm studying in Lincoln and I just thought I'd give hope to anyone out there who might not have started uni yet that is in a relationship and is being told by a lot of people that relationships don't work long distance they can work if you both love each other if you both love each other and you want to make it work then you will like don't let anyone stop you from trying to pursue something that you think will be good in the long run like just don't listen to anyone else focus on you and the other person and you can make it work and I think long distance has been an amazing challenge for me I have grown so independent from it and it's been so great like going to a completely different uni I think it's been such a good thing for me so yeah I just thought I'd let you guys know because I get quite a few questions about long distance and stuff and how it works for me but honestly I think it's such an amazing thing and I'm so happy I'm not reliant on someone else for my happiness like I've grown to love myself and grown into an independent person um, and it's also made me like cherish my relationship more like when me and Aiden are together it, time is more precious because we're not around each other all the time so yeah long distance is a good can be a good thing as well even though it is like I'm not saying it's easy because my heart hurts every time Aiden leaves but I'm um, just saying it can be done and it can be an amazing thing too so yeah thank you very much for watching this vlog I hope you've enjoyed this little Monday vlog um, I'm very excited to vlog the rest of the week as I said I've got lots of fun plans coming up um, and yeah thank you very much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow for another vlog